I'm Kubek and I'm a street artist from Manchester. I always say that street art is art for the people in a way because you don't have to go in a gallery to, to see it. It's a really good way for people to get their message across, whatever message they have, whether it's a social message or political message. Uh, for me, it's almost like a meditative thing. It's, you know, it, it gets me in a zone. At the start of lockdown, I was quite worried. It, it, there was a week or so where I just kind of imagined that no one would get in touch with me to ask me to do any work. We spent a lot of time at home with the kids, which was really nice, just kind of reconnecting with the family a little bit. One of the nice things, kind of halfway through lockdown, I was I was involved in a, an art battle online uh, that was organised by Art Battle Manchester. I managed to do two paintings there that, that were auctioned off for charity that raised over £2,000 for creative people who were struggling around Manchester. The piece I painted on Tib Street actually started life as the piece I painted for the Art Battle charity painting and it was essentially the end of the night on the dance floor at the Hacienda. The lemon was cut in half um, to kind of represent that chopping up of society, you know, the, the way that people have been pulled apart and, and, and made to stay in their houses. You know, it was showing this decay of, of society. The 22 Bees thing that I painted, that was commissioned by the Manchester Evening News. Um, before that, I was painting bees all over the place, so that's why they asked me to do it. That one is probably, for me and for most people that know me, you know, the, the, one of our favourite pieces just because of what it represented. It was a tribute, a memorial piece. So yeah, that was really special, you know, and like the, the, the feedback that I got off it was, was quite overwhelming. After the arena attack, a lot of people came together and created that sense of community, you know, that cared for each other. It's part of the fabric of, of the city now, I suppose. To see the love that, that people give to it, it's, it's just a really nice thing to be involved in. This city's got a history of social and political change. And I think in general, Manchester is a place that people feel positive actions get done. And I think that always kind of runs through people in a way, you know, it's kind of in our veins. I think that's some of the power that street art has, you know, it's not just a picture. You, you, you're actually experiencing what's happening with the public as well. In Manchester, we've got that connection with each other, you know, we're all quite salt of the earth in a way. Mm -hmm.